Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. This video is going to be one that was requested. It is on my cream contouring. This video is going to be a voiceover because I did get a few people saying to me that my videos were getting too long when I was doing a talk through. So you can let me know which you prefer, if you preferred um, when I actually talk my way through it or when I do a voiceover. So please let me know and I'll see you at the other end. Okay guys, so I'm starting off with my Nivea Soft Moisturiser, applying that on my stippling brush and just getting it all over my face to make sure um, that any dry patches or anything are covered. Next I'm going with my Lumi Magic base. It's an illuminating base, as you can see it gives a nice highlighted effect all over the face which is really really nice. Um, it's lovely for people that have dry skin because we're always looking for that dewy finish. So um, I will use this later in the tutorial as you will see. So on the foundation, MAC Studio Sculpt in NC25 and NC30, mixing these together and just stippling them by placing them on the face with the stippling brush. This is just to place the product on the face. I will be buffing it in, as you can see now, with my Wet Damp Beauty Blender. I really love a beauty blender for a nice flawless airbrush finish. Um, and as you will see, I will be using this quite a lot in my tutorial today. Now I'm using my Maybelline under eye concealer and I'm just putting this in two triangles under each eye, down the bridge of my nose, above my forehead, like up my up above my eyebrows as well and down onto um, my top lip and my chin. This is just for my highlight. Next I'm onto my contour of this eBay palette. I'm using the medium brown and I'm putting this just in the contours of my face. So underneath my cheekbones, down the sides of my nose and um, around my forehead and you could put this under your chin as well if you wanted to but um, I just don't in this tutorial. Next I'm using the darkest shade in this palette and this is just so that my contour will actually show up darker on camera. Everything is a bit washed out on camera with bright lights shining in your face so um, I just decided to add this bit in to give my, my face a bit more depth on camera. You can use this if you're into a deeper contour. I'm going into my under eye concealer just under my contour just to give it a much sharper look on camera and in real life. So as you can see I'm back to my beauty blender, I'm just bouncing this on the skin, bouncing and rolling is the best way I can say um, to use your beauty blender. I'm obviously doing my highlight first because I don't want to blend my dark shades which are my contour shades first and then go in with my highlight shades because you're just contaminating your highlight so it will all end up just being a dark strange colour on your face. So make sure you always do your highlight first. Using the tip of the Beauty Blender, as you can see me, I just pointed it out there. I'm using this to blend in and bounce on my contour. I also put my contour under my bottom lip, just to give it a nice under lip shadow. Um, this makes it look like you have a bigger bottom lip. Next I'm going with the peach blush shade in the contour palette and I'm using this as um, a cream blush. I really like a corally peach blush so that's what I'm using. I'm going back in with my Lumi Magique from L'Oreal and I am placing this as a highlight so on the highlights of my cheeks, down my nose, on the tip of my nose and also my top lip. This is an amazing product, I really love it but I have since run out and can't find it anywhere. So next I'm using my NYX Dewy Finish Setting Spray. I really like this one, I've actually repurchased it recently. And this is me looking at myself, admiring myself in the mirror. So guys, there you have it. That is my full face using cream products. The only other makeup I have on are just these strip lashes. But um, it's a really nice dewy finish and really nice for every day. Some girls had asked me to do a cream contour and highlight. So I decided why not do a cream contour highlight blush um under eye concealer everything the whole lot in one check out how to find me on social media down below and please subscribe bye bye